Comprehensive purchase ledger facilities are an integral part of the package. This is the purchase ledger menu. Purchase invoices, payments and credit notes are entered via the Purchase Account Centre, which is the hub for transaction entry and status inquiry. Other menu selections are for the maintenance and report programmes. The Supplier Maintenance Program is where suppliers are added or their details updated. Once added here, they are available for selection in the Purchase Account Centre. Let us suppose that we need to book an invoice received from Photosphere. Then we would select them here and then press the Invoice button at the top of the screen. And now enter the invoice details. Note that the invoice analysis lines can be split across multiple funds. Also, if paid, we can enter the payment details at the same time. When we press the record button, the transaction is totally booked to the nominal and purchase accounts, including the payment if appropriate. If the invoice is not marked as paid, as in this case here, then the payment can be booked later. Back to the Purchase Account Centre, the invoice just booked will be displayed in the Statement Inquiry. At any time, we can output a list of the outstanding invoices and decide which of these need to be paid. Let's suppose we choose to pay Photosphere. In the Purchase Account Centre, press the Payment button at the top of the screen and the outstanding invoices will be displayed from the oldest downwards. Enter the payment details and the amount can be either manually allocated or automatically allocated. And press record to complete the payment. Remittance advice notes can be output for all payments made on any given day. A complete transaction history can be viewed for any supplier as shown here. Any transaction can be selected in the asterisk column on the right of the grid for detailed viewing. And that completes this presentation on the purchase ledger facilities. Thank you for watching.